What's up my people? Bless up on yourself. Welcome back to the channel. Leave a like and also subscribe to the channel. Click the top bell icon to get notified whenever anything new is on the channel. So the first thing I'm going to share with you my people. Man shot dead by half-duty cop in Westmoreland. An half-duty police officer shot and killed a man in Sheffield, Westmoreland on Xmas Day. The deceased has been identified as Omar Brown from the community. Reports from the police are that the half-duty cop was at his home standing at his gate shortly after 10 pm when he heard loud explosions sounding like gunshots some meters away from where he was standing it is alleged that the cop then saw brown running towards him with a firearm in his hand and ordered the now deceased to drop the weapon brown allegedly not comply did not comply and then pointed the gun at the officer according to the police the half-duty cop Pull his lights and glock pistol and fired in the direction of Brown, hitting the gunman who then fell to the ground holding onto a black firearm. The firearm was therefore seized and found to be a Taurus pistol with serial number Irius and loaded with a magazine with three live rounds. The police were summoned and the now deceased was seen lying on his back with gunshot wounds to the head and abdomen. He was later transported by the police to the Savannah Lamar Public General Hospital where he was pronounced. You know what. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section my people. See? And Janua man on launch for Togo engaged cops in Xmas Day shootout. Police have launched a man on fire a man who reportedly engaged a group of law enforcers in a shootout and later fled the scene, a firearm leaving a firearm behind on Xmas Day in Kingston. The Unsbear police said after the incident, which took place on East Street, they retrieved a Taurus Millennium pistol fitted with a magazine containing 11 9mm rounds of ammunition. Reports are that about 3 p.m., lawmen were on patrol in the area when a man was seen along the roadway. Upon seeing the police approaching, the man ran and opened fire at them while evading the police the firearm fell it was retrieved by the police and taken into be processed the man managed to escape the police have since launched a search to find the shooter so let me know what you guys think in the comment section my people six arrested on xmas day after gun found in pro box six people were arrested after the kingston eastern police seize a Arcus 9mm pistol along with a magazine containing two 9mm cartridges along the Bull Bay Main Road in the parish on Xmas Day. Reports from the Elliston Road Police Station are that about 12 p.m. a team of lawmen acting on information signaled the driver of a white Toyota Pro Box to stop. He complied on a search of the vehicle and its occupants result in the discovery of the firearm and ammunition in the front passenger door of the vehicle. The names of those arrested are being withheld pending further investigation. And people may see an article and them say, you know, I mean, a foreigner, I think an American, maybe Jamaican American, was arrested in the six, uh, six person. I want out of the six person will get arrested. You know what I mean? So just let me know what you guys think in the comment section and we are going to move on people a dispute in a westmoreland cause a man in life see man killing bar dispute in westmoreland <coughs> a man was shot dead at a bar in retreat little london in westmoreland and boxing day he has been identified as jamar ranking of the community Reports from the police are that Rankin was involved in a physical altercation with a man at a bar at about 12 o'clock, 12 a.m. that time at midnight, right? Shortly after which loud explosion sounding like gunshots were heard. The now deceased was seen running from the bar along the roadway and subsequently collapsed. Rankin was found suffering from a gunshot wound to the chest. He was assisted to the Savannah Lamar General Hospital by residents, but he was pronounced dead 
on a rival. Jano Star, so it look like the boy the X Mas drinking people turn physical and then turn deadly. You so me I say, boy, me I tell you. So you know when drinking a go on people, emotions get heightened. You know what I mean? And if you not look at vibes with a person, just walk away from it. That's all me have to say. You know what I mean? Because walking away can save you from doing somebody something, even taking a life or losing your life. You see what I mean? I say, and some of the time, as some simple thing people catch up over and it turn deadly, you know. You know what I mean? So just leave your comment in the comment section, my people, and we are going to move on. You see me, I say, yeah, man, walk away from an argument, people. Jano, walk away. I mean, I wonder if nobody never did it, could have part this altercation and not make it reach so far. You see me? So, in a whole hour, you know, my people, a man get caught up after him head to him yard, but him not drop out. You see me, I say? A man was shot multiple times by gunmen while making his way home in Old Arbor Bay, St. Catherine, on Monday night. The injured man remained in hospital. His attackers are being sought by the police. The police report that about 11.40 p.m., the man was riding his bicycle along a track on his way home when he was spawned upon by three men who opened fire he was hit several times including in his abdomen so him get approached by three gunmen my people and the three of them turn their hand upon him see the gunmen then escaped in the area residents then took the injured man to the spanish town hospital where he was admitted for treatment the police were summoned and upon arrival at the scene several spent casing were discovered the Old Arbor Criminal Investigation Branch is investigating. Jano. You know? So it look like say him get the chance to tell the police them a who can him up. You know what I mean? So the police are look for the person them where can him up. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And remember to like this video and also subscribe to the channel if you're not already a subscriber and click the top bell icon so you can get notified whenever there is anything new on the channel bless up on yourself and thanks for watching